Hi. We're sorry to inform you that your video membership will be revoked until you return one of our videos. It's titled, French Made Cafe Spilled Coffee. Please return it soon. Good morning, Mr. Touchdown. I wish you a pleasant journey. Why didn't I call this number in the first place? Uh, hello? Hello? May I ask who's calling? This is the Assassin's Association, right? Look, I gotta talk to you about... Oh, dear. She's done it again, hasn't she? Hey, are you listening? Excuse me for asking, but are you by chance an assassin? Whoa, don't tell the whole world. Then you have been had, sir. You are not her first. What? Run that by me again. Listen to me. Do not get involved, whatever you do. Listen, lady. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Who are you, anyway? Another sorry kid. And for the record, I am Sylvia's mother. Mother? Yes, you heard me. And there's no such thing as an association, or whatever you think exists. You're joking, right? Do you know how many people I've killed? She is a professional con artist. You mean a fraud? Are you telling me this was all just bullshit? She set everything up. Would you mind telling me how far this all went? I'm now second in rank. So, just one more to go. All righty. Why not play along since you've come this far? Are you serious? What's the point? This is all some make-believe charade. But a good man finishes what he started. Fight to the end. Your most formidable opponent awaits in the castle. Now, off to the Garden of Madness. I'm actually starting to enjoy this! Enjoy this! Come on! Enjoy this! I'm actually starting to enjoy this! I'm actually starting to enjoy this! to enjoy this!
wait. I'm missing you up good! Oh, yeah, you see? Uh, no! Go! Yeah! Yeah! Weak! Ha! 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 Oh, 
I never thought you'd make it this far. But I am sorry. I cannot see you anymore. I want to fly to your side right now. I want to be in your arms. I want to be with you. I want to share my life with you, no matter the cost. Meeting you, I felt truly alive for the first time. I mean that. But feelings and reality are two different things. Life is not that simple, yes? Yeah? Now, be honest. Did you really think I would let you do me if you hit number one? You really are an idiot, aren't you, Travis? Come back to reality. I mean, look at yourself. You are a dopey otaku assassin. The bottom of the barrel. No woman would be caught dead with you unless she was a desperate bitch. Where in the world could you find a woman who could fall in love with someone like you? Well, one is right here. It was fun, Travis. I love you. Now, don't forget to use the restroom. Trust your force and head for the garden of madness.
Welcome to my castle. I heartily receive you, my son. All right. Enough with the jokes. A joke? You don't remember me, Travis. I am your true father. Blood does not make such mistakes. Jeez, you are full of it, aren't you? It's a good story. I'll give you that much. This is just another story. Even if you were my father, it doesn't matter. The only thing that matters here is who's best. Remember, son. Engraved into your memory is the night when everything changed. I fell to my feet right before my son's eyes. Do you not remember this? In my deepest memories, I hear someone calling. I remember. It was a hot summer day. There was someone standing behind my father and mother. That person killed my parents. The face, I can't make it out. Who are you? Remember. Who are you? Try harder. I think I can see it. Almost. Do you recognize the face? Now I remember everything. Well done, son. She was the girl you loved. You're still as gullible as ever, Travis. Think, why would he be your father? I guess you're right. I don't have a father, at least not anymore. You killed him, didn't you? Yes. And that's why you became an assassin. To kill me. Now I get it. All those fights. It was for this. I lost everything that I ever cared about. That bitch took everything. I can help you to get even. She's a good con artist, that's for sure. She set up some killer fights. So you and I finally meet. You should thank Sylvia. Jean. There's just one thing I want to ask you. Who are you? Me? You don't need to know. All of your trivial questions will be answered in the afterlife. Answer me! It's impossible. Impossible? What do you mean? It's too terrible. It alone would jack up the age rating of this game even further. So what? Who cares? What if the game gets delayed? You don't want this to become No More Heroes Forever, do you? All right. I'll fast forward this so you can tell me. Okay. I'll make it short and quick. You are my half brother. You know that manga called Miyuki? The Japanese one? Well, it's like that. Your father abandoned my mother. Took her off to your mother. It broke her heart beyond repair. She killed herself. Knowing I had nowhere to go, she took advantage of me. Ever since I can remember, she molested me. We lived in this rotten apartment, and I was his slave. Every day I cursed his soul. I swore that I would kill him one day. The cursing didn't change anything. That's when I decided to become a killer. With no money to pay for training, I paid with my body. But to you, I bet that son of a bitch looked like a hard-working family man. That was all an act. He didn't give two shits about cleaning up my life. So I decided to clean it up myself. That's why I do what I do. And I got what I wanted. Killing him in front of your very eyes. That's my story. Imagine that. You and I. Brother and sister. Now you see what I've been through? Maybe it had to be done. But vengeance begets vengeance. You're right. Go ahead. Draw, brother. All of your sorrows end today, Jean. Yeah! 
last one. Sorry, Jean. This hurts me, too. We're both in the same business, after all. And I've... had enough. Time for you to rest, Jean. Good night, Travis. I hope your next dream is a more pleasant one. It's over. This is where it all ends. Right, Sylvia?
It's finally over. Can a guy get some privacy? At least when he's taking a dump? I'm afraid not. These fights don't work like that. It's time to die, Mr. First Rank. You gotta be shitting me! It's finally over. Can a guy get some privacy? At least when he's taking a dump? I'm afraid not. These fights don't work like that. It's time to die, Mr. First Rank. You gotta be shitting me! Will you hurry up with that? I'll be outside. That was close. Thanks. Ugh. What an idiot. You're a disgrace to yourself and all those you've killed. Huh. <sighs>
I'll tell my promise. Do you even know what you're fighting for? <laughs> Got Travis. Don't make me laugh. Mind if I ask you something? Sure. Why the hell do you call me Travis? Travis, like you're my friend or something. Who the fuck do you think you are? You can't be serious. All this time you didn't realize. What are you talking about? I'm your twin brother. What the hell? That is the craziest shit I've ever heard. Why would you bring up something like that at the very last minute of the game? I would have thought you and the player would have at least expected a twist of fate of some kind! What? Ha! And hey, where's Sylvia anyway? 
she disappeared without a trace. Where the hell is she? You mean my wife. What? Wife? Yes, you know. Spouse. Soulmate. Henry's wife. Get the idea? When did you two get married? Oh, about ten years ago. Yeah, that's right. Because we were both in college at the time. Huh? Oh, shit! All news to me. I'm gonna need shock treatment to get over this one. I'm sorry for all the trouble my wife has caused you. Forgive her. She caused me some trouble, all right. But it helped me clear up a lot of things. Ah, you know how women are. Especially my wife. A really big spender. Yeah, she knew my income wasn't enough, so every now and then she'd just disappear. She's a bad wife, but a good woman. What? Are you telling me that you and her... Oh, come on! <laughs> but Travis, my brother, we're similar in many ways. <laughs> You're right. Suddenly you being my brother doesn't sound so awkward. <laughs> Let me ask you, how do you plan to put an end to all of this? Wait a sec, you want me to tie up all these loose ends? I don't think so. You're the protagonist. I'm just a cool, handsome foil who happens to be your twin brother. Hate to say it, but it's your job. I want to bail, but where the hell's the exit? Oh. There's no way out, is there? <laughs> no getting out, right bro? That's right. All we can do is keep running. Then let's find that exit they call paradise. Let's go!
like this painting, don't you? Hmm. Let's go, Jean. I know. Too bad there won't be a sequel. <laughs>